Hey family, I have a word and my word today is wait on God to send you. I have seen a lot of people get saved today and tomorrow they are ministers. Next week they are prophetess, prophets, apostles, you name them. But the Bible says, as newborn babes, you desire the sincere milk of the word that you may grow thereby. No, you can't just get saved today and jump from milk stage to start eating food. You will choke. A lot of Christians don't want to be ordinary Christians. Everybody want the mic. And you have to be a good servant in order to be a good leader. If you don't wait on the process, fish will swallow you like Jonah. God called everybody, but he did not send everybody. Jeremiah 23 verse 21 says, I have not sent these prophets, yet they run. Because you see, anywhere God send you, provision is there, protection is there, so you don't need zeal and you don't need cash up either. Look at David. He was anointed, but God did not send him until he go through the process. He has to fight the lion, the bear, and the tigers before he fight Goliath. Look at Joseph too. He has to go through the process. He went into the pit. He, he was sold. He went to prison before he became the ruler and go into the palace. So you see, my brothers and sisters, this is to show you that there is a process you have to go through before God send you. Christianity is not a walk in the park, neither a hundred meter race. It is a long distance race. So my brothers and sisters, the race is not for the swift, neither the battle for the strong, is who can endure it to the end. Wait on God to send you. God bless you.